Okay, so Lauren, it was a tough game on Wednesday uh, against a strong Chelsea side, um, and we showed glimpses of what we're trying to do. Uh, we've got a quick turnaround now to face Man City on Sunday. How do we approach that game? Well, we've got to be positive. Um, obviously, it was a big loss against Chelsea. I think, I think the scoreline doesn't reflect on how we played. I think the first 60 minutes, I think we played really well, and we stopped them from um, from doing what what they normally do to teams. Um, but in in the last half hour, they got the th three goals in 10, 15 minutes, which obviously killed the game a little bit for us. Um, but there's a lot of positives to take from the game, and I think we need to go into Man City very positive and confident and this year we're, we're trying something different and we're hopefully just keep pushing and making sure that we're getting better and better each game so hopefully Man City should be should be a good one. So Man City were undefeated in the league last season um, and their defence played a huge part in that they only conceded four goals you scored one of those um, how do we go about breaking down the defence on Sunday? It's going to be hard um, they've, they've got some fantastic players the likes of Steph uh, Lucy, Demi, all top senior internationals. Um, so it was, it's going to be tough, but I think I've, I've confidence in our team. I think we've got a lot more attacking options this season, um, and we've scored a lot more goals than we did last season. So we're we're looking good going forward. Um, so I, f I think we we will be able to break them down. Um, it's just um, it's just whether we score enough and hopefully we stay compact as a group to not concede as many as we did against Chelsea. Mm -hmm. So we've added Joe, Jade and Kirsty to our squad, all three of which made their debuts against Chelsea. Um, are they the type of players that can take us to the next level? Definitely. Um, it, it was really exciting when we found out that them three were coming. Um, obviously Kirsty a great attacking threat. Um, you've you've seen her goal scoring in WSL one over the recent seasons for Birmingham. Um, and obviously Jade and Joe, top senior internationals who've been around in, in the game for a long time. Um, so yeah, it, it just shows that Reading are pushing on as a team and the obviously Kelly and Phil want to push this team to the next level and we don't just want to be competing to stay up in the league we want to be pushing on and and getting as far as we can um, so bringing them free in um, just shows what the what the club wants to do and for fans coming down on Sunday to Adams Park what type of game can they expect to see well it'll be exciting obviously um, the formation we're playing at the moment we're very we're, we're trying to push on attacking wise um, again we're scoring we've scored a lot of goals already um, Obviously, Man City have got some very, got some top internationals, got some great players, the likes of Carly Lloyd. Um, you've seen what she can do, um, and yeah, it will be it will be an exciting game, um, and I'm sure the fans will enjoy it, and hopefully we can get something out of the game.